My car's extended warranty is expired. <laughs> I'm in the middle of a clean out here. Leave me alone. Hello everyone, welcome to Paper and Moose and welcome to the attic of the house clean out. The first home, we are doing a clean out in a half double. One side was one relative's, another side was another relative's. Both are pretty much like a time capsule. And where is the best place to start in a home like this? Obviously the attic. Hopefully that won't fall. Um, that's kind of like, where do you begin? What do you do? My lay that I have, I think that that causes, <laughs> it was a dark and stormy night in the attic. No, that probably looked awful. You know, where do you begin? What do you do? Fortunately, we have a lot of time. Um, so it's not, I need this place cleaned out in a week. Not going to happen. So we can take our time to pick and poke. Because in a place like this, you need to take your time to pick and poke around. Because you just never know what might be in a box, in a bag in a cupboard, who knows? But my favorite places to start are always in the attic and that's what we're going to be doing today. Now when I first went, when we came up here and did the little brief tour, I did find a baggie of vintage Valentines, which we know that I do love. But then I also found this. So this is a vintage Hershey box, the House of Hershey. It did have 72 pieces of milk chocolate bars they're not in here anymore but what is in here are antique valentines oh the problem is this box must have been where the attic was um had some damage but these are wonderful and these will be coming home with me <laughs> Uh, where do we go? Do I start with where there's light? Maybe we should do that. Take advantage of it. I think that's what we'll do. I mean, there's so, there's just so much. I mean, naturally, wherever I go, there has to be some type of noise. And so we have a chainsaw. <laughs> but that's not going to bother me none during this time. So, is that Christmas? I think I see Christmas. I mean, it's, uh, I guess, I guess we're just going to look and see because this is the exploring phase. Oh, wow. It's a straw hat. You don't want to remove it out of the box. Looks like it's probably never worn. It still has like the cellophane wrapper. I don't know if I ate my Wheaties this morning. <laughs> These are rather pretty. Some marbles can do amazingly well online. Especially the older kind, like the cat eye marbles. Well, we did see these. They have the Vintage Christmas. And for those of you that love Vintage Christmas, there's definitely going to be a lot more coming. The box is not in bad shape. And the balls actually look to be in pretty good shape as well. A real photo postcard pretty damaged this one is no oh, mold fortunately the rest of the home the items are still in really nice condition it's just the attic seemed to fare the worst I shouldn't technically have a mask on but these are the satin ones <laughs> oh Here's some more shiny brights. That is a great box. Oh, look how nice. In such great shape. I mean, there's boxes and boxes. We have this box. 
empty, I'm guessing. Yes, but you never know. We might find the anniversary clock at some point. I'll just put that over there. Lots of shoes, but I don't think shoes are in here. Oh, glasses. Oh, cool. Oh, man. <laughs> They're just a little broken. Oh, look at these. I found, I found a pair for me. All right. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Why do they look upside down? Oh yeah, I look great. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, they're all sorts of glasses. Oh, those are, mm. And we have a stamp. What's the year on here? The latest year is 19, 83. <laughs> Interesting. 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 They sure like their shoe boxes. Look at this one. Bates Floataways. That's a pretty neat box. It says electric glue gun. Is that what's really in here? Yes. <laughs> But hey, you just never know. That's the glue pieces. Now, let me move some stuff so you can get a better view with me. As we go through. Santa Novelties, Inc. More red. They must have liked the color red. I like that box. Oh. Ooh, what's in here? What's in here? Can we see? This is a great... I think I might have sneaked a peek at this box before, but I just love the old style the box. You have some light bulbs. No my safety fuses. The box is what's cute. The sweetest story ever told. Night's homemade candy. Wallpaper. Oh, we have some tumblers. See if you could see the tumblers. Those are fun. It's ice cubes, cups, swizzle sticks, candy. Bicentennial. <laughs> you always find bicentennial anywhere you go. It's a must. And then you have these plates. English Village. That's it for that box. Oh, cool. They're games. I think you can see. Bingo. Popular with crafters. Sew by number. the graphics on this American logs by wholesome that's really cool more bingo we have monopoly and depending on when this came out this could be worth a decent amount of money I don't think this is one of the older ones older like old disc one but A nice shape with all the pieces. Play this tonight. Yes, we are staying here overnight. <laughs> uh, I'll be making a video about that. Oh, National Electro Boy. 
the plastic model kit. Has it been done? Oh, wow. That's cool. We might have to look this one up. Being a Christian. Oh, what's this? Oh. Darn it. <laughs> it was Domino's in the box. Look at the box. Ten flacked Christmas folders for children. That's adorable. We'll put this in my pile. Here's another box. Walkables. They love their shoe boxes. It seems that they use these for anything and everything. What's inside? What's inside? Shoes. <laughs> Those are pretty nice. Those are fancy. Now it looks like we have some books. Oh my gosh, Snap Together VW Bug. I don't want to. Oh my gosh, has this not been put together yet? Oh, cool. That's so neat. Well, it looks like we have some children's artwork. Oh. God is love. So they put together their own little scrapbook. There's their turkey for Thanksgiving. Yes, it's all their like schoolwork. My poems. I learned to write. And then we have a ship. We have some flippers for when I want to go into the ocean. The forest and the fort. Oh, that's nice. McCormick Daring. I don't think this is a match though, because this is Farmall. But then look at these cool crows that are in here. Do they go on there? Those are really neat. This is not metal, it is plastic. Still a cool find. Boy Scout, Cub Scout belt. We have some horseshoes, and then Roy Rogers and the Rimrod, Rimrod Renegades. So they have a lot of commodes. There's one commode there, uh, and another commode under here. But there's some interesting things. Lots of boxes. This crate has something in it. I don't know if we could see what's in there. But we're gonna take a look at some of the boxes over here, see what we could find. I apologize for the lighting, but the electric up here is not that great, so we have to make do uh, with what we have. So let's see what we have over here, shall we? Oh, wow. Ooh. Perfume. Oh, what's this case? Oh my. What do we think's in there? Ooh, that's a Gillette case. Doesn't have the razor, but it does have... Oh, I thought that was a lighter. It's not. Huh. That's a nice Gillette case, though. Some of these, they're empty. Regents Avon. Good old Avon. This is cool. This has the town name on it and from the old doctor. That's fun. Nice little old bottle. Oh jeez. Okay, this is a scam from San Diego, California. Hello? We've been trying to reach you concerning your 
My car's extended warranty is expired. <laughs> I'm in the middle of a clean out here. Leave me alone. Oh, look at that little jar. I think I've seen them before. Creamy lime bath bubbles. That's fun. We have some of the curtain tiebacks. Those are rather pretty. These are empty, so they just save the bottle. Another curtain tie back to go with it, the ribbon. Some shaving, a lather brush, hard right lather brush in the original box. Triple bromides, Eli Lilly and Company. Here's the nice shaving. Oh, that's a sturdy one. So this is fun. All sorts of little things in here. Nature's Remedy laxative tablets. This is a fun little box of things. Some of these empty bottles, depending on where they're from, these look like they're mostly Avon. They could be worth something, but just fun to see what they kept all these years. <sighs> now the commode. <laughs> oh, there's stuff in here and it's not, not toilet related. <laughs> Let's see what's inside. Alrighty. So folks, we have an old commode here, but there isn't anything toilet related inside. Instead, ooh, there might be some pretty cool things. bring it out into the light. Oh, they're tins. Now, do the tins have things in them? That's the question. No. Satin finish Madison. That's cute. Christmas. You can store buttons, bottles, all sorts of things that you want in here. Did not expect to find these in here, that's for sure.